Hey, what's cracking YouTube? Blazing Medic here in the orchard again. Gonna give you an update since we are almost about to uh, prune. Gonna go ahead and show you a mid fall situation here. It's actually winter, but the leaves are just now starting to fall here. Um, the fig is gonna stay mostly. Uh, mostly green throughout the winter. Got to prune off some of these suckers down here around the graft site. And if you check out here with the almond tree, you have the growth from last year has already lost its leaves and turned into budwood. And the new growth hasn't quite yet lost its uh, foliage, so uh, <clears throat> it's not ready to be trimmed yet. Got to wait for everything to lose its leaves. Um, the citrus trees won't lose their leaves. They'll keep producing through the winter and growing. But the tangelo here has got quite a lot of fruit on it. But I don't know if anything's ready yet. Alright, this hell. Something fell here. We could take that up and check it out. This hand is kind of boring still. Here you go. <clears throat> the persimmon tree is uh, fully dormant now. So it can be pruned. Um, any time now, but you can see still has the buds, still has the buds on the stalk. That's where the new growth will come out. Grapefruit tree. The blood orange tree looks like it's starting to ripen here. Yeah. Starting to ripen. It's still green, but they are ripening at least. I gotta get out here and pull some weeds here. In the next week or so. <clears throat> Orange tree. The lime tree. So this one got hit with thrips pretty bad, if you guys remember. But on this new growth, there's no thrip lines. So all this new growth here, no thrip lines. It's all nice and healthy. Avocado tree. Small avocados. Small little guys. But uh, if you guys didn't know, avocados have to be picked or else they won't ripen. They'll just uh, sit on the tree and rot. So you do have to pick them for them to ripen. And now the peach tree is uh, definitely losing its leaves. You can see it's changing colors and its leaves are just coming off quite easy. So. Hopefully in a month or so we can show you how to prune a fruit tree up. <clears throat> and even just now, the uh, the nectarine tree isn't even showing signs of, uh, I guess just barely at the lower leaves is starting to show signs. So you can see they start to change colors before they fall. 
and the apricot just now is showing. The apricot and the apples are just now showing signs. See this? This is what'll happen. It'll turn this color before the leaves fall off. You can see it's just now starting to change on the lower side. Same thing with the apple tree. The apple tree is just now starting to change color, so in about a month we'll be able to do some pruning on everything out here. And then the lemon tree is looking real good now. I left a lot of the lemons on it so that we could use it uh, for baking in the winter time. So citrus trees will actually preserve the fruit for you. So if you don't need it, you don't have to pick it when it's ripe. You can leave it on the tree for a few months if you want to to uh, keep it preserved. Just make sure you come out here and uh, check to see if they fall off and you know pick them up off the ground. But other than that, they stay pretty fresh on the tree for a while. Alright guys. I'm going to catch you guys all later. Peace.